here I am adjusting my world a little bit sitting around writing in my journal had my coffee I got my coffee and my Nola cup right here cheers whoa baby and the journals right here I had my pickled egg for breakfast that was yummy pulled my tarot card I got ordinariness ordinariness is you know that's the nature of life uh, life is pretty ordinary most of what you do is washing dishes washing clothes cleaning house that's the nature of life if you can't appreciate the ordinary you're not going to have a good ride if you saw the bicycle wreck video from yesterday I want you to know that I'm much better I actually got a good night's rest my knee is healing up I can breathe without pain for the most part so I think I'm getting well one day at a time At least I hope I am. Today I'm going to go into the town probably. Need to pick up some things. I would like to get some bandages to make my first aid kit a little more complete. My first aid kit suck. Kit sucks, man. I mean, it's really limited. And I want to go to the liquor store. To get some vodka and I want to go to um, maybe I'll go to the Winn-Dixie for hummus I do think I will go to the O'Reilly Auto Parts because I need antifreeze the cheap leaves, leaves is about a gallon of antifreeze a month and nobody can figure out where that antifreeze is going to as long as I don't forget to put more in we're good but if I forget it ain't so good running hot running hot ain't fun ain't fun nope I need some more coffee. Needed two cups today in my hunter counter coffee pot. I really don't like this thing, but it, it does make good coffee. Oh, a little dark over here. Pour it in the cup. This is my one bottle bar. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Time to sit down and enjoy this. Back over here for a little while. Kind of gray looking outside this morning. And one of my ongoing problems is that my Jeep just loses radiator fluid and freeze. About a gallon a month if I drive very much. It's a royal pain, you know? So I have to keep checking it. And I filled it up again today. So carry around my own air compressor. In case I have to fill up these big old tires. Not today, but soon. That was easy. Somewhere in this mess. I wonder what's in there. I should look in there and see if I need to keep that. Need the bag clothes. Arts and crafts, air compressor, shoes, I got a world of shit in there. Bag for carrying clothes. Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, that's heavy. It's an empty little thing, but it will overheat if you do you know, more than two tires at a time. Run it very long, have to let it cool off. I need to buy something so we can do that today when we go to the auto parts store. For Things anything. that need to be done, hey? Need to replace that little sucker so it matches those. It fell off one day. Looks like rain today though, so it probably won't happen. I've got the paint. Well, I learned that while I was moving down that little air compressor out there that uh, my chest hurts from falling down on a bicycle wreck yesterday. So I don't need to be lifting anything heavy for a couple of days, so because it hurts, but that's okay. My uh, trip to the dumpster for the last few days, that's done. Here's the lovely marina. Good food in the uh, grill there. They're letting the water down out of the lake like they do every year. 
So they pulled these boats out so they won't get in the bottom when the water goes down. Probably this week coming up, I think. It's a beautiful lake. I enjoy staying here. Great blue heron out there. It's kind of far. Maybe I can make it bigger when I put the video together. I'll try. There's a gray one that stays right here at the marina, and there's a big white one that I see regularly. Oh, wow, well, there goes a seaplane. I often walk out here in the mornings from the RV down here and back is a little over a mile. It's a nice walk. It's a nice walk. And it's beautiful down here in the sunrise. So here we go off to Columbiana, man. That'll be a thing. CVS, liquor store, and the uh, maybe the auto parts store. I don't know. That's a nice truck. Look at that, eh? A real beauty. Old Dodge. This looks possibly good, eh? Damn. I got a bandage, it doesn't really fit, but it's better than nothing. So I went in and improved the quality of my first aid kit. $43 worth of supplies. What a thing that was, eh? It's worth it. Hey, it's bizarro, but and there's some bizarro wacky do stuff. So this is how this alley looks today after the uh, bicycle wreck. Not too shabby. A little road rash, but it's cleaner. The one on my knee, I got covered up. I went to the CVS and bought a damn, bought a uh, big, almost big enough Band-Aid. Bought some other stuff too. It's still crunchy under there. Ain't no fun. I'm doing good, man. I have a... Uh, Started doing stuff, getting ready for the road to hit the road again in a couple of weeks. Taking stuff down, stowing stuff away, uh, doing things on the outside of the RV. It's good. Taking it easy though, because it can't go too fast, eh? Because my, this this will hurt, okay? Uh, but it's better than it was yesterday. I mean, you know, I mean, I can sit around and feel comfortable and breathe, and I can cough again. So that's a good thing. Almost dark. I didn't make it to the grocery store and I didn't make it to the auto parts store, but that's okay. Nothing I needed, nothing I couldn't live without for a few days. Y'all have a great evening. Talk to you later. Rock and roll. Peace out.